CVI Lumens versus ANSI Lumens. What is the difference? So, you're staring at lumens and scratching your head, aren't you? We've got CVI Lumens on one side, ANSI Lumens tugging at the other, and you're trying not to get knocked over in the middle of this luminary tug of war. Let's clear the air a bit. First, let's talk ANSI Lumens. That stands for American National Standards Institute. They're like the referees in the game of light measurement. ANSI is pretty strict about how lumens are calculated. Their method requires using a specific setup with precise conditions to ensure that the brightness measurement is standardized across different devices. Think of it as the universally accepted measuring stick in the bright world of projectors. When you see ANSI lumens quoted, you know exactly what you're getting into. It's a measurement you can trust to be pretty consistent from one projector to another. That's because everyone is playing by the same rules. Now, on to CVI lumens. Frankly, before someone brought this term up over coffee, I'd never heard of it, and I live in Portland. We take our coffee and tech talk seriously. After some digging, I found out CVIA is less of a standardized unit and more of a marketing term. Manufacturers may say CVIA lumens to make their projectors sound ultra-bright, but without the rigorous testing to back it up. It's like someone saying, trust me, this is good, but not showing you the nutrition facts. If you're looking for the practical difference, imagine you're planning to set up a backyard cinema. If you pick a projector with a high ANSI lumen rating, you're likely to have a bright enough image even with some ambient light floating around. Ah, those Portland summers. On the other hand, the CVIA rating might not be as reliable because, well, it's not following the same rule book. Here's what you should take away from this. When you're comparing projectors and you want to be sure of the brightness, stick to ANSI lumens. It's the benchmark for a reason. CVIA lumens might sound flashy, but without the standardization, it's like comparing apples to some mystery fruit. You just don't know what you're going to get. So, stay informed and let the ANSI lumen be your guide. Brighter isn't always better if you can't measure it properly. And in the illuminating words of a certain someone, stay natural and healthy, live a good life. Same goes for your projector choice, I'd say.